Hey guys, I'm Carl and welcome back to SMA, the home office edition. So we're going to do something just a little bit different today and something that I probably won't be doing a whole lot of in the future, but I got something and I figured I would do kind of a mini unboxing here. Not a major unboxing because usually unboxing stuff is a lot of tech things and I don't want to go into that so much. But we'll talk about what I got here, why I got it and where I'm going with it. So, let's cut her open. Watch me cut my hand on YouTube, yay! All right. Uh, all right, so, what I bought was I bought a Panasonic uh, G95. Um, and so this is, it was, is an open box camera. So normally they're, I think, they're 1200 bucks brand new. Um, this is a, an open box thing, so it's basically a new camera, which I got for, I think, $860. Um, so let's talk a little bit about why I got this. Um, so as I talked about before, um, back in March, we went, to, uh, we went to Hawaii. And it was something that we'd planned for years out, and something that we'd been looking forward to and we were going to be there for a month. I had an extra week uh, of vacation this year so we thought we, what we would do is we would um, spend basically all of March in Hawaii. But you may have noticed that there was this thing in the news and maybe, maybe you missed it. This whole coronavirus thing and it forced us to leave Hawaii uh, 11 days early so um, we didn't get to go to the Kauai like we were supposed to. We went to Maui, we went to Oahu, and then came home. So, given that we didn't spend that extra money there, I had a little bit set aside, kind of, sort of. Um, and then the other thing is that during this whole coronavirus thing, I've really, really struggled with um, looking too much at the, the news on the internet and how bad things are, what's the economy going to do. Uh, my job is kind of iffy as to whether or not I'll get to keep it. And every day that I keep it, it's a good day. Um, so my, my wife thought it would probably be good to distract me with something, so I bought this. So let's talk about why I bought it as far as long term. So um, I we are outdoorsy people. We do a lot of... Um, water sports and things like that and last year I did a, a summer music video for all the stuff that we did we water skied and tubed and I, I have a couple of small sailboats so we sailed a lot um, and I like doing those sorts of things so how I've recorded them up to this point is one on that phone right there that Samsung S9 Plus that I used this guy here hopefully you can see this my GoPro which I love quite a bit and then this year we added the drone we added the, the Mavic Mini so because I recorded so much on the phone um, I was running into limitations with it particularly anything that was low light and anything that was at a distance and so I started thinking about should I get a new phone um, so I could record on that the more I thought about it like the, the latest Samsung phone, I think uh, the, the S20 Ultra, is, uh, is 1400 bucks. So this year I bought the drone, and that was 500 And then I got this guy here, uh, which is a micro four-thirds camera, um, and this was 860 bucks. So combined, the drone and the, the, the regular real camera are less than a brand new phone. My old phone there works fine. I love my phone actually. I like the layout of it. I like the headphone jack. I like the the Bixby button, which I have set to Android Auto or Android uh, Assistant. So uh, I, I, there's no reason I needed a new phone. And by using getting the, this camera here and the drone especially, I'm able to get shots that I couldn't get before. Um, so for the YouTube channel. I think going forward it'll probably largely still be the GoPro because for just doing vloggy stuff when you're out hiking or things like that nothing beats the GoPro it is got just great stabilization it is of course waterproof um, 
it's always in focus. It's got a wide angle view, so you never have to worry if you're on the screen or not. You just put it in front of you and you're being recorded. It's super easy, super light. I can stick this baby in my pocket. I can carry it anywhere. If you decide to do a little vloggy thing in front of people, half the time they don't even know it because it is so small. Love the GoPro for that sort of thing. So this camera here probably won't be a whole lot for the channel. What I'm seeing me doing with this is recording the kids um, on, tu uh, on tubing from the back of a boat. Um, this thing is water sealed. It is um, it has great stabilization for a regular camera. So I, I think it'll be stuff like that. Plus, um, whenever I'm doing low light stuff, plays, um, shooting things like that, or I'm indoors, because the GoPro, you should never use the GoPro indoors. So, set these aside. Let's open this thing up and see what we got here. All right. Instructions. I may or may not read these. Probably not. Yeah, owner's manual, that kind of stuff. Product, product registration. Ooh, my first real camera. I'm very excited about this. That is a lot smaller than I was expecting. You ever see them on the, what do you call it, on the uh, YouTube videos, they look very big, but that's not too, too bad at all. That's actually kind of perfect. Again, it's water sealed. It's, it's got a little bit of heft to it. Feels good in the hand. Um, in theory, it's got a flippy screen. Ah, there it is. So I got this thing that I can turn forward if I ever wanted to do a vloggy thing. Again, I don't know that I will use this too much for the YouTube channel, though shots like this, I probably would do. I'd, I think I could see myself putting that on a tripod and uh, shooting that air. Man, that feels good though. I really like the size of that. That's about perfect. All right. What else we got? Ah, the, the camera strap. Got to have a camera strap. Got the kit lens and the, the hood. Now, anything else in here? battery, charging cable, I'm guessing this is going to be a charge for some sort. Yep, got the charger. Cool beans. And then a wall plug thing. Not exactly sure how this all works. I guess we'll find out. All right, so anyways, let's uh, take this thing off. The sensor in there. Is the first time I've ever put a lens on a camera. Crazy. That is not bad at all. Well, I am very excited to use this. All right, so this was just a, a quick little look at, at the new camera. Um, we'll be using this some for indoor stuff. I'm looking forward to taking some pictures with it. We've been hiking a lot. Um, in fact, you're gonna have some hiking videos coming. We were, recorded one the other day. I think that video will probably come after this one. I'll probably release it after this one. And maybe we'll do some, some pictures and a little bit of video stuff with this while hiking just for fun. Um, so, thank you for uh, coming and joining us. Hope you have a great day. Hope you're staying, staying safe. Take care.